a lot of things happened that we cannot speak about. This right here might be the worst decision we've ever made. What happened that night, all of us will remember forever, and we all 100% believe in an afterlife and things that are other than humans because of what we saw. Today we got permission to stay in the haunted room 340 aka the most haunted hotel room in America. They have not opened up this room to anybody in like years. If there are any spirits here, please make yourself apparent. A face just popped in front of my eyes for like a point for like half a second are you serious? and then disappeared. Wait, behind, what? Jake, something's behind me. Okay. Whatever, whatever we just summoned in there is here. Holy sh! You were dude! Holy f We were all talking about leaving right this second and the faucet turns on. Look no. at my eyes, bro. This is real. So it's almost like the spirits know we're filming right We don't care if you believe us. That proved it to us right there. This room's haunted. So, this is a video that we were never expecting to film just because of how traumatic of an experience it was for us and the roommates. We left out a certain part of our first Queen Mary video for a very specific reason, and today we are going to be sharing that. But before we do, we need to, we need to throw out a few disclaimers first. One is that we know there are a lot of skeptics out there. We are prepared for that, and we know that no matter what, unless you were there, there is no way for us to prove that 100% that this is real. Most people who watch this are not going to believe that it actually happened, but honestly, it changed our lives so much that we, we, can't, we can't do anything about it if you guys don't believe it. It's fine if you guys don't believe it. There are five full-grown dudes that will swear everything in their life that this is true. With that being said, we are going to give a quick summary of everything that happened before the following audio clip here in a second. But before that, it is advised that if you haven't already, watch the entire part one Queen Mary experience. I would highly advise you guys, if you're watching this on a phone, if you want the full experience to maybe get a computer or a laptop out, uh, put some headphones in there just so you can hear everything, everything's loud and clear. But one last quick disclaimer, the remaining footage that we have to show you today, none of us, besides Aaron, knew that we were being recorded. Knowing that, we act slightly different and we say things that <laughs> we didn't think were ever going to be recorded. This is 100% raw, guys. This is a real experience that we had no idea we'd be able to show you guys, so hope you enjoy. Okay guys, so we got all the roommates, Corey, Aaron, and Jake here to tell the rest of the story. Just to give you guys a brief outline, we're gonna go over why we even went there in the first place, what happened all the way up until Aaron started recording the audio file. For those of you who do not know this, Queen Mary is probably one of the top 10 most haunted places in the world. And we stayed overnight in this room called room B340, which is known as like the top five most haunted places on the most haunted ship in the world because a lot of people died on there 50 have died just in that Multiple. one room alone 50 people have died in one room and we decided to stay in it um. <laughs> they only had opened this room up to the public for what like a month mm -hmm. yeah and so us being the group we are we were just like you know what this is gonna be a great idea for us to all stay overnight as long as possible for the entire six or seven hours that we were there we tried time and time again to get any sort of ghost contact because if there is any sort of proving ghosts are real, spirits are real, there's an afterlife, it would be at this exact room. And we probably spent about, what, seven, eight hours just filming our video, staying in the room. Obviously we didn't film every single second. Mm -hmm. We didn't hear one thing and we're all very skeptical people. And we were basically giving up at the end of the night of, all right, this is bullshit. 
Yeah, I, definitely not haunted. I even sat in there by myself alone. Didn't mm -hmm. do anything. We've tried multiple times, like you said, alone as a group, on and off camera, to try to contact anything. If anything was in the air, we asked it for hours to show itself. And where this story starts is at the very end of the night. So if you remember from part one of the Queen Mary, we all decided, like Colby said, you know what? This is just garbage, like, we gotta leave. And as soon as we decided to leave, this is our first conscious decision for the entire night to actually go home. Camera's off. The faucet turns on. Mind you, we are all more than 15 feet away from the bathroom. The faucet had not turned on, even trickled water in over an hour. We have no explanation for that. Sam jumped up to grab his camera, and the second he did that, the faucet turned right back off. It's almost like it knew when we were filming and when we weren't. So the fact that it made a sign, or whatever was there, made a sign of the faucet, when we tried to leave, we decided, hey, maybe this is our chance. If it's in the room, it gave us some sort of sign, maybe we should turn off the cameras, and we should try this one last time. And so we did. I turned off my camera. We all promised we weren't filming this. We sat in the same area, lights off, and focused. And that's when things started to happen. I just recorded without telling anyone, and so they had no clue of it until after. Yeah, shout out to Aaron, because again, we all, we thought this was gonna be off camera because that's when all the paranormal stuff was happening to us, but Aaron decided to secretly grab his phone and start audio recording the entire thing. If you can take a mental image of this, we're all sitting around in B340, completely silent, waiting for another response right after the faucet turned off. In the pitch dark. We asked out to whatever was there, whoever was listening, that if that was them who turned on the faucet to make a sign, please make yourself known. I think we can agree that we are all very skeptical people. Uh, we never have really believed in paranormal stuff or ghosts before, so we are very on edge and are very excited actually to show you what we captured. Again, we don't care if you think this is real, if you think it's fake. We're all here today, able to swear in our lives that this happened, at least to us. Believe it or not, this is our experience. Talking, you just like, like birds. Birds. Still going on. It sounds like an animal, though. It's outside. That's a thug's nose inside. Yeah. Someone up? Maybe. Can you give us one more thud? Make one more thud if that was you turning on the water.
is weird. It's like really weird. But like those two sound sensitive when you thought it was something scary, right? Mm -hmm. Like the thing, if you like think about it, listen, like. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Uh. I say turn off the lights when I ask you one more question. If it doesn't respond, then we'll, you guys ready to peace out? Yeah. yeah. It's almost 5 a.m. All right. Just for fun. That was pretty nice. Well. <laughs> what? Like the light. Thank you for giving us signs. At least one. Yes. That was good. I believe you're there. Just asking for one more sign of proof. You guys hear that? You just hear those three knocks? Yeah, knocks. Was that you that just knocked? Open a door, do something, turn on water again. Is anyone there? We're down with the tricks. Did you guys just hear that? Hear what? I just heard a hum. You did? I didn't I hear that. I didn't. She's hiding in the bathroom. Can we give it one more minute and then let's dip? Alright, this is this is one more minute and then we're leaving. So if you wanna show yourself in any way, now's your chance. Besides those three knocks. Is that like Did y'all just hear the knocks again? Yep. That was like five. Wow. That's besides those three knocks, so okay, I'll give you five knocks. Yeah, where's that where's that coming from now? Let me, let me ask Over you by Jake. Jake. Ooh, no, turn the light off, turn the light off. I heard it like straight back to the bathroom. Yeah, I heard it towards Jake. Okay, that, that was the bathroom. So I said besides those three knocks, I gave four. Do you want us to leave? Or do you want us to stay? One knock for yes to to leave. Any more than one knock to stay. stay. What the fuck? That was four. That was four, four knocks. So turn the light off. Keep the light off. This could be this could be her way of communicating. Keep the light off. Keep the light off. That was five. That was Wait, what? One knock. Leave. Wait, what? More than that to stay. Yeah, keep the light up. They want us to stay. Why do you want us to stay? No, Are you lonely? Yes or no. Yes or no Are you lonely? We'll knock once for no, more than once for yes. One knock. That was one knock. So you're not lonely. Is there more than one of you? Knock once for yes. Knock more than once for no. Well, let's ask questions of like cool questions. You know? Ask if they ran the water. No, no, no. It's, we're leading up to that. Ask it again. Are you, is there more than one of you? Knock once for yes. Knock more than once for no.
I heard one. one. So there's more than one of you. What the fuck? What the fuck's happening? Wait, it, does that mean that means there's, there's more than one? Yeah, there's, yes, there's yeah. more than one. Wait, keep the that light. That means up, there's the more up. than one spirit. Sure, sure, keep, the light up. keep the light up. Okay. There's nothing wrong with that. Are you a good spirit? Knock once for yes. Knock any more than once for no. Are you a good human spirit being anything? Once for yes, anything more than once for no. That's no. Holy shit. That's what? no, bro. Dude, we are actually talking Wait, so much. Wait, okay. Here, ready? Turn the light off. Turn the light off. Turn the light off. Do you mean to cause us harm? Once hey, for hey, yes? No, no, no. No, 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 wait, no, 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 listen, listen. Here, let me ask you. I want to know. I don't. Why not? Listen. Shh, 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 shh. We have more time. Are you... Do you want to keep talking to us? Knock once for yes, more than once for no. I think they're they're interested, dude. They're interested in us, but they're an evil spirit. Hmm. What do you say? They're not a good spirit, but they want to keep talking to us. Mm -hmm. Why? Aaron, I think you should ask that question. Okay. Do you mean to cause us harm? I, Knock once for yes, more than once. I don't think I don't, don't think that, that we should ask don't that at all. What? Like, I, don't, I don't know, cause that's not. You know, just, then we should know that we need to know if we need to leave or not. Yeah, because if they mean it causes harm. Well, I mean, then let's ask if we should leave. Right. Should we'll we? Okay. Leave their home. Should we leave? Knock once for yes, more than once for no. Didn't we say that already? I I can asked you, if we should can stay. You, can we ask if they ran the faucet? Like that's the biggest question. Okay. Let's did ask you her. did you, you run this right now? Okay. I know. Okay, okay ready? I, ask that. I'll do it. I'll, I'll ask, ask it then. Did you run the faucet? Knock once for yes, more than once for no. Ask it again, but there's there's multiple of them. So just say. Did you? Did any of you, did any of you mean to run the faucet? Knock once for yes. Knock more than once for no. That's one knock. Okay. One more time. No, one more time. Yeah. Okay. I'm asking one more time. Did any of you run the faucet? Knock once for yes, more than once for no. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Yeah. So these guys are in here bad spirit and they ran the faucet mm -hmm. so let's ask if it wants us to leave again because that's not what it's answering okay 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 <clears throat> okay got it we are going to leave just say if dude. we should we leave knock once for yes twice for no or more than once for no No. 
He just, they don't want us to leave. They don't want us to leave. Wow. Dude, this is fucking unreal. What the fuck are we doing with our lives? It is only knocking when we Yo, ask a question. Hey, ask what you want right now. Yes or no question. Yeah, man. This yeah, is This is you. This is legit, you know, no cameras, no none of that. We're yeah. just, we're just being real. We're actually talking. Ask him if the camera's good. You know? I want to know if... Yeah, was the camera too much? You yeah. know? Okay, I got a question. Ask if I ghosts are real. I think that this real. light's okay, too. By Dude, ask if I, ghosts I think are real. it works better if we can all focus without the light. Do you want us... Wait, wait, wait. No, ask if ghosts are so real. So one is usually yes, and that knocked right after you said we could focus better, and then it went knock. Yeah. Did I, I would say light, a light off. Let's just, yeah. let's just make this thing like... Do you want us to keep this a secret? Do you not want us to be put you guys on camera? Knock once for yes. Knock more than once for no. Maybe it doesn't know what a camera is, bro. Okay, maybe not. Oh. Let me ask a let me ask a question. Um, I want to know. Ask if it was scared of the device we were walking around with earlier. You know, it was a camera. I want to I want to know some cool. like stuff about like the spirit world and stuff. I don't I don't want to ask that. Man. A, we, I just want to know. If, time. Well, I'm gonna. Yeah, so everyone, I say I hope everyone ask one question. And leave. Okay. 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 Well, then then Jake start. I got a I got a question, but you guys don't want me to ask it. Okay, but I want to know. It, ask it. Okay. Turn off the light. Are ghosts in the spirit world completely real? Like once for yes, more than once for no. Just ask if they're still here. I got it. They haven't answered the last two questions. Are you guys still here? Knock once for yes. Knock more than once for no. I think that means we are going to leave now. Let's try one last question. Thank you guys for talking to us. Yes, thank you. Thank you for knocking and answering our questions. And running the faucet. Showing us that spirits are real and you're here. Um, What's one more question? I'm pretty, I'm okay with all that. Yeah, I'm pretty good with that. Okay, no, I got it. I got it. Have, have a question. I, yeah. Okay. Yeah. Just in. I have a good question though. Okay. Um. Okay. If you guys, yeah. if you, if you guys are still here, meeting you guys other than uh, my group of friends that I'm with right now, if you guys were here at the beginning of the night knock once and if you just got here recently around three o'clock ish then knock more than once oh recently bro recently i have uh i have just one last question for you it's not anything bad okay um Recently, bro. Okay, okay, wait. Light, really quick. Wait, one question before you go. No. Don't double knock. It's a no. Like, don't leave. Don't leave. Or no more questions. Or no more questions. I don't know.
depends on if they answer this next one. Well, if they don't answer it, then they don't answer it. It's fine. Okay. I literally going to say... It just said uh, no. Don't. It just said no. Don't. Okay. It just walked again. Okay. Thank you for talking to us. Okay. You guys ready? Thank you. Thank you so much for talking we're, to us. We're going to leave. <clears throat> we'll leave you back to your room now. We enjoyed your company. Okay. Should we ask him if we actually leave? Yeah, no, I think, I think so. I, think, I, mean, I think we're They don't want any more questions, but I'm quite, that's not even like a question. That's like, shit, we're going to go now. I legit was, all I was going to ask was if they wanted to tell us anything before we left. Mm-hmm. But that's all I was going to ask. Oh, yeah. I think if they wanted us to know anything before we left. You know, well. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Do you want us to leave? One knock for yes. Anything more than one knock for no. Every single time they ask it, they don't want us to leave. They don't want us to leave. But they don't want us to ask. What about this? What about this? You know, whenever we asked if they were alone, and they said they're not alone. There's no alone. Yeah, but also, also maybe our company makes them not feel alone. Like they don't want us. So we're here with them. We're hanging out with them. Here, could you turn them on? But they don't want us to like keep bothering them. Right. Said yes. Right. 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 Doesn't want us to keep bothering. <laughs> so okay, ready? Wait, 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 wait. Do you want to continue to talk to us, or are you done talking? Knock once for yes, more than once for no. That was like three knocks. Does that mean they're so not no. talking? No. That means they're done. They, they don't, don't want to keep talking. talking to but us, they don't but want they us to leave. leave. Yo, but they went one knock right when I caught that. Mm-hmm. Did you catch that? Mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah. It's like you finished. When I was one knock. saying, I was like, right? And then it went. So they want us to hang out here and stay with them to keep yeah. them company, but they don't want us to keep talking to them. Yeah. So should we respect that? Yeah, I mean, I should. I mean, well, let's, let's hang out for a little bit longer. You know, obviously, like, clean up the room. Because we did get the room a little dirty. Okay, and then let's just head out. Yeah, maybe. We'll see what happens. Okay. But yeah, let's just go ahead and clean up. Okay. Yeah? Let's go. I don't know. Guys, like, you understand nothing like this will ever happen again. That's why I kind of want to keep asking more questions. Well, I don't know if they want to talk to us, though. That's the thing. We're talking to people. I think I just, that it just, sounds like it said that it likes our company, and yeah. it likes that they're not alone, but they don't want to keep answering questions. I, d- yes. I just want to know. Exactly. I just want to know if they've talked to other right. people like they talked to us. Did it just knock one time? Probably. I don't I know. I agree with you. I just want to know if they've talked to more people than just us. It doesn't really Dude, because as soon as... That every single time we've tried to leave, they do something. Mm-hmm. Like, they're trying to get us to stay. Like, the one time like we were about to get up... That was turned on the faucet. Oh my god. Yes. Yes. That was one loud boom. And they just said yes. I just got chills all over my I just fucking got chills body. All over. Whoa. So you want us to stay? We'll stay. Whoa. What the fuck is happening right now? Whoa. Jesus Christ. Wow. I want I want to test one thing. I'm still skeptical. Someone might be outside. Listen to what we're saying. So, someone asked them a question and it was completely me. under their breath. So no one out there would be able to make those knocks and we'll not understand if it's a real speaker or not. Okay. okay. Is, it, is it you guys, are you guys in this room right now? Once for yes, two for no, or more for the one for it? no?
like, dude, there's there's no one out there, bro. The bangs are coming from all the way so, that way. Seriously, this is. You got chills. Okay, well, someone go outside while Sam's in here and let's start talking and then we can debunk. No way. No, no, you go out there and then you hear us talk. What's up, Sam? Are you good? Yeah. What's, you good? Yeah. You sure? Yeah, you just look freaked out as crap right there. You good? Yeah. There you go, turn on the light. Jake, turn on the light. You want me to? Yeah. You good? Yeah. Turn on the light. Oh my god. Are you good, bro? Yeah. No. Turn on the light. What's wrong? Why? What's wrong? Let's go. What's wrong? Come on. What? Wait, what is wrong? Let's just though? go. Okay. Let's go. What's wrong? Let's leave? Yeah. They don't want us to leave. They don't want us to leave. Okay, well, we got a home and we got a job to do. I mean, Why is that? What's the, what happened with Sam? What happened though? He, he just looked freaked out for a bit. I just didn't look like Sam. He looked freaked out, that's all. Right? No, fine. <laughs> Ask me Dude, me and Jake both were looking at you. <laughs> I, I was looking at Sam, you and Sam, I'm not that gonna That didn't look you. Like look, you. you look scared. For like three seconds, you were just like this. Yeah, but before he did that, he was he shaked. Right? Yeah, you remember shaking, right? Getting the yeah. chills in. And then you were just like... Did you zone out or I, something? I just, you were literally staring at the Ouija board, just going... I was just staring into your light. You it's sure? Weird. You yeah. seeing shit? It's yeah. bright, dude. Your light's bright, so that makes sense. I think he's... Dude, this has never happened to any of us. Like, of course... This is like the first thing. I know, but... <sighs> like, I, I want to talk about it, but... It's just like... Well, dude, this is like not going to happen. Probably ever again unless you want to try to debunk it right now this okay. is real this is completely Dude, real what what was the question where they went the boom <clears throat> the loud one no, we like you don't was, want us to leave right yeah you want us to stay but that came like it sounded like it hit our closet like I felt the no I thought it was down there it fell underneath it like, like, fell like underneath like, 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 like here they really did, you really you guys really don't want us to leave huh yeah lights on so they're not gonna talk I just, you want to try to I just you think want to go outside that the room and have I appreciate it very much for talking to us, but it said that it was a bad spirit. Yeah. You know? Okay, can we? Well, how about if we say are all of them bad? Ask them if they're all bad. Yeah, there's one. Because there might okay. be some. Well, some pop bad. the light off really quick so we can do it then. Jesus. Are all of the spirits that are here bad? Knock once for yes, more than once for no. Spirits. Are all of the people that are here bad? Knock once for yes, more than once for no. That was okay, I'm good now. Let's see, yes. Let's go. They're all bad. They're all yeah. bad spirits. And they're not, not but, hey. <laughs> but hey, thank you for talking to us. Thank you so much for talking to us. Yeah, we really appreciate it. And hope we've never enjoyed our company. We've never experienced anything like this before, especially as a group together. That's incredible. Do you want us to tell your story or not? Knock once for yes, knock anymore, and once for no. It's no. They cut you off soon. They said no. no. Knocked only once. Yeah, only knocked only once. Really? Yeah. Can you, can you do that again, please? Would you like to, for us to tell your story? Knock once for yes. Talk anything more for no. It's a definite no. Yeah, that was about That's that was about five, five or six knocks. Yeah. Okay. They're evil okay. spirits and they don't want us to talk about it. Okay, light on the general public. So I mean, hey, we'll think of it this way, like you know, there they might be evil spirits and whatnot. They just don't want us to talk about it because maybe you know we just shun it. Really, talk about maybe we can talk about it. But I don't think they like being the called story. exactly. I don't think they like being called spirits. <laughs> Whatever that is here, yeah. Well, then, well, then let's maybe they messed up that. Are yeah, you all so good only, spirits? Yo, the only thing I want to know is what he was originally going to ask. Okay. What should we ask that? What's that? Alright, last question. 
their bad intentions to yeah. what do you say so? why would you want to I don't want to ask uh, yeah. that. Like, well, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get out of the room for that one. But would you, would, wouldn't you want to know? No, it's, I, I don't want it to even be an option. Yeah, you I don't know think so saying? either. Like I that's like you know, like we're talking and we're learning, but I don't want to bring like negativity and like stuff like that. Exactly, into it. exactly. Like I well, want. Okay, I mean, we got. They don't want us to leave, and they enjoy our company. They can hear us right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, no, I know. no, I'm just okay. saying. Is like if they enjoy our company, then let's just infer. That they like us, even if they're bad. Yeah, spirits, I just say like you us. like us. Then. Mm-hmm. Okay. Yeah. Do you like us? Are you enjoying our company? Knock once for yes. Anything more or no? Perfect. Yes. I do enjoy your company. Well, I'm glad that we can. Well, we enjoy your company. We enjoy your company yes. too. Oh man. This has been amazing. This is really fun. Holy cow. This is the, you guys are incredible. Same, even when we ask the same answers, we always get the same amount of knocks. Mm-hmm. You guys want to get deep on this? They don't want us to leave. Well, they don't want us to ask questions either. Well, that was a while ago. I just want to ask one more thing. Okay, last thing. Uh, I'll wait off. Yeah. I just want to know one thing. Um, is there any sort of heaven? Knock once for yes, knock anything more for no. That's how I know. Mm-hmm. That's how I know. That's All how right. I know. We gotta go. We gotta go. Come on, guys. We gotta go. This is I can't. Uh, we gotta go now. Let's go. go now. Turn the light. Turn the light. Turn the light. Turn the light on. Trust Seriously, me. Trust girl. me. We gotta go. Turn the light on now. Turn the light on. Guys, when you guys freak out, it just. Trust guys, me. I'll tell you what. I tell you why once we get out of the room. Yeah. That was a lot more, that was a lot more intense than I remember. Holy crap. Every single time we would ask a question, it would answer. And only it would knock when we are trying to ask the question. And like Jake pointed out right at the end, every time we'd ask a different sort of question, it would have the exact same answer. So when we would ask, are you alone? No. Are you with people? Yes. Are there multiple of you? Yes. It always stuck to the same storyline. You know what scares the crap out of me, bro? What? The fact that there were absolutely zero knocks in between us not asking questions. Mm-hmm. There were only knocks after the yeah. question. We literally did not hear knocks. And the times that we did, where, where there were knocks in between questions, it was like cutting us off. Like, yeah, it's saying we, we shouldn't leave. And we were like, yes. And something to add, I don't think we really talked about it in the audio tape. The knocks themselves were on different parts of the room. One would be in the closet, then under us, then on at the roof. And when that huge one hit after we made that big realization, it was like, yes. Mm-hmm. It felt like the entire floor was shaking. Shook. Yeah. It was the like, whole room should not leave. It oh, felt like an earthquake. Facts, bro. It felt like as if if there was like a metal door directly under our room, someone just slammed it as hard as they could and it shook our entire room. No, that's the thing. Room, room B340 mm-hmm. is at the bottom of the ship. There is nothing under it. So it could not have come from no beneath way. us. No way. There is nothing that could be beneath us. It's at the end of the hallway, so other than on yeah. our left side, that would be the only yeah. place that the knocks could come from, well, and that's not where they were coming from. We had a window to the ship, so we could see out the side. We had knocks coming from that window next to the bed. I was going to say, yeah. go out there? I was like, how? One of the knocks sounded like it was coming from the window. I think the most important thing is that we told it that we weren't going to tell anybody about it. The fact that it said, are you a bad spirit? Yes. Do you want us to share your story? No. This right here might be the worst decision we've ever made. Weird stuff that's been happening at our house, like after we came back from the Queen Mary, it's like, 
is this only is posting this a good idea? Shut up. I'm serious. Like, just think about it. It's like giving away that secret or exposing this. Is that something they're going to find out about? The way that I'm looking at it is like we didn't in any way really attach ourselves to it. And they, it's been three yeah. months. Yes. Yeah, so yeah, they can't find the link. We truly, truly, truly don't really know how this stuff works. Well, like, there's a possibility that it could. What if they are attached to us? Like, we so, never know. Aaron, I think you should explain why you thought it was such a bad thing at the end. I'm a Christian. I grew up in Texas, and one of the things uh, we learn about in the uh, Bible is that demons will try to convince you that heaven is not real. And that kind of three knocks at the end. When I asked, is there a heaven? Yeah, it proved was... to you that it was trying to convince us that there was no heaven. But they're still doing knocks at the same time, so maybe just think that they're demons, not really spirits. And we're not saying that they were demons or anything spiritual like that. Could have been anything, to be honest, we don't know, but just something to keep in yeah. mind. It was definitely something evil that we were talking to. One, it was bad. Two, it wanted to keep us there. It did not want us to leave. And three, it was trying to convince us there is no heaven, just so FYI, guys. Mm -hmm. Oh, and not to post this. Yeah. yeah. Let's try to get everything straight one more time of what all happened that night. So we proved at the very, very beginning that whatever that was, that was knocking, was the same entity that made the faucet go. Yeah. Correct? Yes. Yeah. There were more than one entity in the There room. were multiple, they said that. <laughs> For sure. On six different occasions, yeah. there was times we would ask it, how many are you? would address them as them. The one time that he addressed them as one person, like, did you, it didn't answer. Mm -hmm. And the knocks were different in different places. It wasn't all the same yeah. area. We've established multiple times that it was not a good spirit mm -hmm. and that it liked us because we were there. But every single time we would try to leave, including the very initial time when the faucet turned on, it would make some sort of noise or sign that we should not leave. It would attract us to come back because I knew what we wanted. It seemed like it wasn't giving us input until we talked about leaving. Maybe it was thinking, all right, well, since I want them to stay, I better keep communicating them because they want to leave. I don't understand. Maybe you guys can like explain this. Whenever we would try to ask it questions, like, do you want to talk to us? It would say no. Right? Yeah. But then whenever we were about to leave and saying, all right, screw this, like we're leaving, it would stay. want us to stay. And yeah. it said it was lonely. It said it wasn't lonely. Because there was multiple. Oh, yeah. So it wanted us to stay there with them and it liked oh. us staying there, what if but it's... it was a bad spirit that didn't want us to leave. I remember one of the biggest things you were saying on the morning that we got back, like you were just referencing earlier, what if it needed time? to attach itself to us. And it was gaining power and didn't want it, they just wanted to sit there and shut up and okay. not leave. And it was there because of yeah. it. Well, to attach itself. do you remember whenever you like blacked out, remember you were just gazing off mm -hmm. like into like my light? Yeah, do you talk remember about that? that too. From my perspective, we were all asking questions and then I'm pretty sure we were deciding that we wanted to leave, right? Mm -hmm. Like we wanted to get up. So Corey turned on his light. It was like, almost like I was like hypnotized. And the only reason I know that is because last week I literally got hypnotized. I heard you and I knew what was going on, but for some reason I just, it, I mentally did not want to answer. And just That's to know, so in my opinion, I think it's all bullshit. And he was just like, He's shocked. I don't think anything happened to you, to be honest. No, me neither. But, but okay, but yet 50 people somehow died in that room. Maybe I was just in shock. That's what I'm You saying. know, like if something that traumatic was happening and an yeah. experience that makes you believe in something you never have believed in before, mm -hmm. like I was probably just like, holy Exactly. It doesn't mean like, that you're I was probably, possessed yeah. or blacking out or something. When Corey said, like, you didn't look like you, like, I agree with him there. Your body was there and your eyes were just. You look yeah, like you're, you look like, too. bro, we were just not. talking you look like your spirit, though. Like, yeah, I like, well, I was shocked. Yeah, but Sam was literally he's gonna sitting be like there like this. He's, he's, he's the biggest that. skeptic I've ever seen in my That's life. That's what I'm That's saying. Why. why would Sam just go? Yeah, but did you well, see? Okay, him? imagine that. Okay, did you see? The biggest skeptic in the entire world all of a sudden has one 30 minute experience that makes me believe in everything that's ever happened in my my life. Okay. I probably am like, holy. Uh, yeah, of course it's like that. It's not like, oh, he's. Then playing. why didn't you do that, Colby? Because I am not a skeptic. Like yeah, he, he is very religious. Why didn't Jake do that? I'm the hugest skeptic. I think you're fine, but like, I'm just saying, like, what you looked like, you didn't, you just looked like you weren't there. What I think we're trying to say is, there was a very good reason why we decided to keep this story. And we needed the three months to reflect on that and be comfortable sharing this with you guys. And I hope after that entire audio file was played for you guys, you have an understanding of what happened to us that night. And whether or not you believe it, that is completely up to you. We're not doing this to 
make you guys believe in a specific thing, whether it be like something spiritual or religious. This is just something that happened to us and we wanted to share it with you guys. I don't yeah. really want it to be posted because we kind of yeah. told <laughs> when we want it posted. When we were leaving, all of us agreed that we were never going to share it. We felt like we made a deal with it. We swore that we wouldn't tell we're anyone. We're family. All we're saying is why would we go to this much trouble if it wasn't something that actually happened. Why would we wait three months right. to release a part two video? So then? whether you believe it or not, honestly, we don't care. It happened to us and it's gonna affect our lives forever. We just wanted to share it with you guys. I'm gonna tell my grandkids. Yeah, like you guys can't see this on Ghost Adventures, Ghostbusters. Like, dude, this is raw footage of six guys oh, being scared to death. I have one suggestion though. Sam. Uh, Sam. We told ourselves, we made a pact, mm -hmm. that we would never go back. And there is no ounce of me that ever wants to go back. However, it was mm -hmm. named on Time Magazine's top 10 most haunted places in the world and BU340 is now closed, so there is no option for us to go back to that place. Okay. However, there are four more places in the world that are more haunted than room C. <laughs> <laughs> So I am wondering oh, what? if this video gets another 250,000 likes. Make it 300. Dude, they're gonna get that in like a day. Well then make it 300,000. No, 500,000 likes. 300,000 likes, we will hit one of the four places that are more haunted than B340. Are you guys Jeez. down? Yeah. Dude, I'm but down. There's no promises that anything is gonna happen there. You go there and nothing could happen. It could be a normal happen. crap video. We're yeah, we're literally saying, being yeah. so real. 300,000? 300,000. 300,000? 300,000? 300,000. 300,000. Do you believe in God? Yes. You got the power of God. He just said yourself. yes! You're oh! Hope you enjoyed that video again. What? Huge, huge thanks to these guys for going along with us and doing this crazy yeah, stuff. Thanks, Make sure to subscribe to them. Subscribe to us. We're gonna be going. If you guys get the light, to a very, very haunted place very yeah. soon. And again, uh, please tell us what you think about all of this situation in the comments because we're, we're curious and we want to figure, like this is a us and you process. We're trying to figure out what happened here. If there's anything we didn't hear, yeah. comment section, yeah. we would love to hear it. Dude, yeah, because yeah, they're like little investigators, dude. Yeah. Hey, facts. Dude, I thought that I honestly heard some voices whenever we were hearing it, but mm -hmm. we didn't rewind it. So, yo, if y'all heard anything, yeah. Crazy, decides knocks and whatnot. Comment down below because I want to see that. All right, guys. But on that note, again, just thank you for watching. Thank you for at least attempting to believe our situation. I hope you do. I hope you do. Even though that was I don't care if they do or not. Yep. Yeah. Honestly, it doesn't really matter. Go get the new merch. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> uh, we'll see you guys next Sunday. So, adios. Peace.